I had a dream one night that I could never forget. In this dream, a very tall man in a white robe, whom I assumed was an angel, was guiding me through a very large plain. It may have been the plain of Megiddo in Israel, but that's just a guess since we were talking about King Solomon. He pointed in the distance and said to me, Most think that Solomon's downfall started when he took many wives, but it really all started way before that when he went to this church. I looked beyond to where he was pointing, and I saw a massive black cathedral made of wrought iron and very creepy looking, like something you'd see in Mordor from The Lord of the Rings. When we walked inside, I expected the inside to be just as creepy, and a seance going on, or a human sacrifice. But to my surprise, the inside appeared to be a typical American megachurch. The church was packed with people of all kinds. A man in a suit standing by the door to the sanctuary greets me like he has seen me before and awkwardly shakes my hand. I've, I've, done, I've been doing better, you know, reading my Bible more, he claimed. I didn't think I've ever met him, but he recognized me from somewhere. I realized that he was the pastor of the church. And why he was telling me this when I didn't know him from Adam, I saw right through his lie. He wasn't reading his Bible at all before and doubted that he was now. The blaring music begun, and the angel and I took our seats near the back. The angel sat still, watching as the rock concert that pretended to be worship of God commenced. Everyone stood up, many clapping their hands. Only the angel and I remain sitting. Halfway through the song, I found myself beginning to clap along. And the angel turned to me with a brazen face. I stopped immediately, his eyes glaring at me in fury. You having fun? <laughs>